Hi there guys, I'm Chris Bowden and welcome to the Geek Group. We're here today on the front lawn of the Geek Group's Heavy Industries Labs with the Evervescent Kevin Nicepants, Head of Public Relations for the Geek Group. And we have a TIAC CD224E made in December 2001. It's a CD-ROM drive from an IBM ThinkPad laptop, the uh, R31 series. So we're going to test it out here with the Geek Group Solar Death Ray. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Yes, it fries. No, it doesn't smell good. Yeah, you're downwind on that one, aren't you? Oh, God. Oh. Wow. Oh. Oh. Man, that's that's potent. There you go. That's that's science right there. That's <laughs> so yeah, it fries. That was the mouth. <laughs> you might get a shot over here. We'll come back to that. It's in, spun, it's in ball of flames. It's still burning. We we did the one on the It's still burning. It kind of makes me want to be careful about keeping fire near mice. <laughs> Not only do they burn, they don't stop burning. That's evil. Wow. I mean, we've got like super high winds. That was out. And I just set it over here till we were done with the shoot. Wow. That's really burning. Yeah. That's not kind of burning. No, that's not just a little, like okay, it's still kind of lit. It's actually virtue burning. Yes. Oh. Oh. Oh, a bit well, of it's getting smaller. <laughs> we have a wire now. It's that thing I was, I would keep that wire in case I needed it later. Hey, it's an there IC you go. And it is still whole. Yeah, yeah, the IC survived. Here. The, what? the integrated circuit. There's a computer chip right here. It's socket, it desoldered itself from everything, but the chip itself is completely fine. They're made out of a ceramic compound or something like that. So they well, is that here, the, we'll where's the right wheel? There. Is that the wheel? Where? Right here. Yeah, there's the wheel. And oh, whoa. whoa, that oh, stinks. Jesus. Okay. Wow. Yeah, there's the wheel. That's that's pretty icky. So who wants to stop it out? <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna let it burn. Yeah, get that on your shoe. <laughs> Alright, let's let's go back to our other one and see how that's going. Does anybody remember? No, oh, it died. Oh, I wonder what the thermometer's doing. <laughs> <laughs> thermometer's up at a thousand again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh wow. Look at that. Mike, can you zoom in on that? What am I looking for? Look at the ah, spot right there. Got it. Set it flat so that the, the drive is... Oh, hey, open it. Open it? Yeah. I don't think I can. Get your the Gerber. No, I, yeah, I, 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 I don't think you guys understand. I'm pretty sure it's, it's, <laughs> it's shut. Here, I'll see if I can open it. Give me a second here. I'll try it right in the front. Don't stare at that. It's the smell. Oh. Yeah, let's put some water on it. Can we boil, water boil with laptop uh, drive? Yeah, it boils. It's over a thousand degrees. Water boils at <laughs> like 212. <laughs> Oh, so it's it's the ambiance. Yeah. That's that's what we're selling here. All right, Kevin. I think the official verdict is yes. It does indeed fry. Agreed. So you guys have fun. We'll have more for you next time here at the Geek Group. 
if you uh, want to learn more about the Geek Group, because we do a lot more than just you know play with solar death rays, check us out at www.thegeekgroup.org. Um, everyone with a sincere and passionate desire to learn is welcome to be a member. That's what we're here for. We're a place for people to come and get together and hang out and play with science. And even if it's just stuff like this, it doesn't exactly have a practical application. We just do this for fun.